So it's the end of the year. And as always, Kai take a lot of annual leave, low pay leave, sick leave, or whatever, emergency leave, whatever. So I will just take this time to show you some tips that everyone can do. And this time is interior photography. So I come to this lovely digital web office. And of course, the camera itself. Look at it. It is the Nikon two shift lens, 24 millimeters. Look at it. Isn't it ugly? But it's useful. So let me show you. So now we try to take a photo of the digital web office because we don't have to rent any other places. So um, I should use a tripod, but. Um, Anyway, so you use a tilt shift lens. Last time when Kai showed you about a tilt shift lens, a lot of people don't really understand why you have, a, have to use such an ugly lens and heavy and expensive. Oh, well, why not I don't just use Photoshop? Well, let me show you why this is better than Photoshop sometimes. So if I just take a photo here, just whatever. It's a bit weird if you want to show the interior design, this office. So we want all the vertical line to be exactly vertical. Something like this. So that photo is all right. But what if I, I want more, more people and desk, but less ceiling? Position is this high, and then we can shift it down. and have something like this. Of course, you can take a photo of everything distort and then use a Photoshop to correct it. If you correct the distortion, you lost a lot of pixels, then the result photos may be not big enough. And secondly, it lost time which if, if you're doing a job, a paid job, that losing time is losing money. So stop saying that, oh, I can just Photoshop it, uh, whatever. So another challenge is this digital web reception counter thing. Relatively simple, I found this framing, which I like. Those chairs is a bit dark. It's merged together with that shitty PC. So, I'm going to add one speed light. So this distance is a bit short, so I think I will have to use quite low power setting. Um, it's a bit too high. <laughs> I also want to highlight this first class check-in design here. Very interesting design. So I want to add one more fresh light pointing to this. Okay, let's see. Oops, forgot the flashlight. Does it matter? It's digital. Can I go? Whoa! <laughs> this is... Now this one is already the lowest power setting, so I have to very simple, just take it. Let's see. Disappeared. <laughs> Try to use less layers. Just a lot of trial and error. Okay, so this is just some simple tips for anyone can do. Uh, it's not a very, very decent professional shot, but just for demonstration purpose. Um, these are just skills, so after that it's just up to your creativity and aesthetic sense. Aesthetic sense, yeah, okay. See you.